it's Eugenia. It's New Year's today and I thought in honor of it being New Year's I would do a kind of like New Year's themed Q&A. I went on my Twitter and I asked you guys to ask me some New Year's-y questions. A lot of them weren't really about New Year's which is totally fine because I don't really get that into New Year's anyways. Like I don't really know how much I could have answered about New Year's. I thought I would do that so I'm going to answer you guys' questions today and stuff so yeah. Here we go. Sarah the Mermaid asked me, how are you so pretty? Thank you, Sarah the Mermaid. I'm really not, but thank you. What was the best part of 2015? Obviously the new Star Wars movie coming out because I've already seen it so many times that it just came out. But I don't know, I guess a lot of kind of cool things happened in 2015. I always love getting to like go to any kind of like events or anything like that where I get to meet you guys because you guys are always like really really nice. It's always really fun to get to meet you guys and that's always cool. So Ashton asked me, what are your 2K16 goals? I know this is like really really bad probably, but I literally like never make resolutions like any year, like ever. But I definitely want to keep doing YouTube and just like keep making you guys happy because getting to hear I make some of you guys happy is always like such a good feeling and I'm really glad I can make you guys happy. So I definitely want to keep doing that and keep going along with that further. I want to like make a lot more videos for you guys and like do more you nows. So I guess be a part of that great internet world. What do you look forward to for 2016? I am extremely looking forward to the new Panic at the Disco CD coming out. Like I'm super excited for that because all the songs so far have been so good. So I'm like really, really excited. What is a resolution that you've been making for years and still haven't done to become a unicorn? It's just not happening for some reason. I don't know why. How does it feel to have to do your heavy makeup every day? I'm really used to doing it at this point. Me, it just kind of like comes naturally pretty much. Like I don't really mind doing it because like I'm very used to doing it. So yeah. Princess Emo asked me, are you going to VidCon 2015? And I should be going to VidCon, so if you're going, then I'll see you there and I can't wait to meet you. All Time Melanie asked me my favorite Hello Kitty thing that I own. My favorite Hello Kitty is probably my black Hello Kitty that was like a MAC makeup like exclusive, like special kind of thing, like limited edition special thing. I love that Hello Kitty so much, so probably that. What would you do if your ears and arms switched places? That would be really strange. I guess that means I would like hear kind of out of my shoulders, which would be super awkward. And I also guess that means that like I would have like arms coming out of my head and people would probably stare at me like, what is wrong with this girl? <laughs> How do you get your hair to be so perfect? Thank you so much, Jess Q. I really don't feel like it's always perfect. Like I'm constantly kind of paranoid about my hair. Even right now as I'm making this video, I'm like worrying if my hair looks okay enough or not. I just kind of um, like tease it and I have it cut in kind of a certain way where I kind of just like sweep it over and just kind of hairspray it. And I use Tresemme Freeze Hairspray because Trace May literally makes like the best hairspray if you really want your hair to stay and stuff. So that's the one I'd recommend. It's like really good. Are you my mom? Apparently I'm everyone's mom because so many people call me mom. I just literally don't feel like a mother to anybody. So I don't know. How's it like to be the most awesome person in the world? I am not the most awesome person in the world. You'd have to ask that to like whoever is the most awesome person in the world. Probably you. Melody asked me if I could turn into a small animal, what animal would I turn into? I would kind of like to turn into like a small little dog or something or a bunny or something because they're really cute, so yeah. If you could wear one outfit for the rest of your life, what outfit would it be? First one I think of is like like my fishnets with like my skull skirt and like my like see-through kind of skull top because I really like that outfit a lot, but that's really hard because I um, like like a lot of my outfits, or like my anime, like schoolgirl outfit. I don't know, that's so hard. Was Foreman Vega asked me, did you party on New Year's Eve? Totally. I was on You Now for like four hours, so partying it up right there. I actually like don't even drink or anything, so I'm like super boring like that. But I also saw Star Wars for like the fourth time yesterday. That is like the way to celebrate because that movie is so good. Vicky asked me my favorite cat. My favorite cat is Hello Kitty because Hello Kitty is so cute. Would you rather spend only a week with Jack Skellington or a day with Patrick Stump? I would probably fall in love with um, Jack Skellington really quick, so it would be a really 
depressing life after that week. I really love Fall Out Boy, they're like one of the best bands ever, so I'm kind of leaning towards a date with Patrick Stump because I really would be really sad, you know? He's married anyway, so I don't want to steal him because I'm not like that. I'm just gonna go with that because with Jack, I feel like I'm gonna be so depressed after a week. I know he's with Sally, but it's like a cartoon, it's different, so. How do I feel about porn? I feel like porn is a pretty extreme world. I don't really watch porn like at all, so yeah. Brianna Baker asked me if you could choose one person to rule the world, who would it be? Me, obviously. I'd probably choose like Jack Skellington or somebody because Jack would be the best ruler ever. Can I get the disco or 21 Pilots, by the way? I love you. I love you too. I love both of them a lot. They're both like definitely um, two of my favorite bands, like for sure. I would probably have to go with Panic, but I will love 21 Pilots too. That's really difficult. Like that's hard. It's Cube asked, will this be in the Q&A? Yes, it will. Nice unicorn emojis. Are you moving to LA anytime soon? Actually, maybe moving to LA like later this year. So I'm really, really excited about that. So hopefully that all ends up working out and yeah. Harrison asked me if you had to choose between YouTube and music, what would you choose? I wouldn't want to leave you guys ever. So I would actually probably go with YouTube. I would have like nothing without YouTube, so yeah. Will we ever see the real Eugenia again? There's actually this weird, weird video on YouTube about me about how apparently I'm actually a clone and the real Eugenia is like dead or whatever and I must have murdered her, I guess. Uh, so I guess she's gone forever. What happened to Henry? Henry's right here. I would never leave behind Henry. Henry is like the best son in the world. Bring me the horizon cloud asked me what scares you? This is like a super lame one, but bugs scare really like scare me like super bad. Like if I see like a spider or anything, I like freak out and it's like the scariest thing ever to me. You just like foot fetishes, you know what I'm saying? I don't hate people with foot fetishes, but I just find the whole thing kind of weird because like I've never felt an attraction to feet like that. There are people are like, show me your feet. I just don't get it. It's like weird to me. You'd rather be bald for the rest of your life. Bald, sorry, I have no eyebrows for the rest of your life. I think I'd rather have no eyebrows because I guess I could try to draw them on, which I'd prefer not to do, but it would be better than not having hair. Bite Me asked me my favorite Sonic game. I used to be super obsessed with Sonic. I really loved like adventure and adventure 2. I actually liked Sonic Heroes even though like everyone hated that game for some reason. I had like a lot of good games back in the day. If you had to choose between Jack Skellington and Sally, who would you pick? Sally is awesome, but I would definitely pick Jack because Jack is like my favorite character ever pretty much. Bonnie Cena asked me my favorite Pokemon. My favorite Pokemon is Pikachu. I know that's like the most cliche answer, but he's so cute. So I just love Pikachu a lot. DC or Marvel and your favorite superhero. I don't really pay too much attention to like either of them, so I don't really know if I can give like a completely fair opinion. I think I'm gonna say DC, and my favorite superhero is like Batman because he's like a cool, dark superhero. So yeah, I guess that's why I go to with DC because he's like my favorite, so yeah. And thank you guys for watching this video, and thank you to everyone who sent me questions, and happy new year to you guys. I'm definitely gonna make a lot of new videos this year, so yay. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up, and subscribe if you want and stuff, and yeah, talk to you guys soon. All right, bye guys.